All right. Good time to pop back over to the Rimac Concept 1 special event. Just had a chance to highlight a little bit of stage 8 earlier, so we're up to the stage 9 then. The Inferno Automobile Inferno, which we don't think I have start up very high either. I think I only have that at 1 star as well. Yep. Which have quite a few blueprints short on that to be able to do much more with it. I actually had difficulty with the Epic Pre that they had for the Inferno. Wasn't able to qualify for it. I had somewhat decent time in practice, but I couldn't get it to land when trying to submit the time. Hitting barrel rolls wrong and shaking off walls and running my head and whatever. Doesn't make for good time trail time. Also didn't help that a lot of people that qualified above me wanted two or even three star inferno so maybe he's gonna advantage as well. Vehicle startup power, all I needed to do was finish, but still. I might have been able to check out the first round of the finals for the Epic Pre this morning as well, but. I think it was 500 tokens to still get you a free entry, but I'm not sure where that would actually put me tier wise. And it's already too late for me to finish the other conditions from qualifying round, so I'm selling some extra blueprints to post the round, honestly. More annoyed by they really have much use for the epic import parts because I don't have my vehicle start up that high, but it would be nice to get a few extra blueprints and I've been able to get it up to a two star. You should think it handles better with blue nitro than like the standard when it's moving forward like that. Almost got 146. Yep, yeah, that would actually been fast enough to get the five star when you did under 47. Do it again.
that time we're going to 46. Alright. There's an awful lot for us to do in this stage, unfortunately. I'm not fortunate we might be able to get some extra ones later if I decide to crack up some car packs for it, but be the only way for me to get much from that. Ooh, again, 